And with the heat index numbers in the triple digits today, we all really do need to take precautions. Dayton Children's is seeing this as the perfect opportunity to warn you of the deadly dangers of leaving children and animals unattended in vehicles. News reporter Devro Bogart has more in our team coverage. That's right. Last year, 42 children died after being left in hot cars across the U.S. And this week's heat is just kicking off, urging Day and Children's to issue this public health concern. Jessica Saunders says every parent thinks it will not happen to them, but we live in the age of distraction and tragedy can strike any family. Five minutes can turn into 10 minutes, and we can see that a car can go. Um, it can increase by 19 degrees within about 10 minutes on a hot day like today. So even if you feel a breeze, the car traps hot air in and the temperature increases. The child's body heats up a lot faster than an adult's. So we might get in the car and think it's okay, but um, for that child, it, it can be life and death. So far in 2018, there have been 13 child deaths related to hot cars. On average, about 37 occur each year nationwide. As Dayton Children's shows us with a little test, temperatures like today's can reach deadly in just minutes. And the windows are cracked and it's still 101 degrees inside of this vehicle. Which means even rolling down a window is not a solution. Saunders says one tip to ensuring the child's safety is setting up a reminder. If you are not the typical caregiver that takes care of a child, make sure that other caregiver calls you and reminds you to drop the child off. And if you see a child or animal in a hot car, immediately call 911. There were a couple near misses here in the Dayton region last year where 911 was called, and that's a good thing. And some more tips are to leave your phone, purse, or maybe briefcase in the back, serving as just another reminder to again look in that back seat if you have to grab those items before you head in. Devereaux Bogart, 2 News, working for you.